Hi, my name is Beth Sheldrake and I'm the Educational Psychologist with Helen Sanderson Associates. Today I'm going to talk a bit about appreciation, what we mean by appreciation and how we can go about finding out about the things that others really like and admire about our children. So by appreciation we mean finding out about a person's positive characteristics, the gifts and their strengths. It, that can then help the person or our children develop a strong sense of themselves as valued individuals. This can then in turn have a positive effect on their well-being and their self-esteem. It's also great for us as parents to hear what other things people have to say about our children. So you can start with yourself if you want, but you also need to get on board all the other people that know your child well. So think about the school setting. Think about family, think about friends. Now some of the ways of gathering some likes and admires might be to start with sending a postcard. And we've got examples of the postcards here. So sending a postcard to a family member or a friend and just asking them to jot down three things that they, that they appreciate about your child. You might just want to send a text instead if you find that too difficult. But it's nice to have the postcard as a keepsake. You've got it forever. As I say, it's really nice to hear the positive things said about your children. So the same in school. Ask a teacher or an adult that knows your child really well. Ask them to fill in a postcard. If they're getting stuck for words, we've got some brilliant think cards that have got some great words that you could use on here. So assertive, generous, trustworthy. There's lots on here. When you're using statements, use strong statements. Try and avoid words like generally or sometimes because that can mean, well, he's sometimes assertive. Well, that can sort of say, but a lot of the time he's not. So we want to avoid words like that. It's great for your son or daughter to hear what their friends and classmates like and admire about them. So ask them too. One of the things that I've done in the past is to keep a little whiteboard on the fridge in the kitchen. So when people come round, I ask them to just jot down now and again things that they like and admire about my kids. It's great for your children to see it, but it's also nice for you to keep as well. Aim to collect at least five good quality statements from people about your child, things that they really like and admire about them. It's great to see your child just grow in pride when, when you tell them what's been said about them. I have seen children literally grow and glow with pleasure. So it's lovely. Enjoy it.